Let's move on now. Pakistani court indicted Imran Khan and his deputy in an official secret act case. It comes as another blow to the electoral ambitions of the former uh, Pakistani prime minister who currently or who is currently being held in a prison near Islamabad. Imran Khan was jailed in August for three years on graft charges. The sentence was later overturned, but Imran Khan remained in custody on a far more serious charge of sharing state documents. The case relates to a cable that Khan had touted as proof that he was ousted as part of a conspiracy by the United States and the military establishment. The United States and Pakistan military have both denied the claim. Vice Chairman of Khan's Pakistan Tariqa in South Party, Shah Mahmoud Qureshi, a former foreign minister, has also been indicted in the case that carries a maximum jail term of 14 years. No Pakistani Prime Minister has yet completed a full term. Politicians have been frequently arrested and jailed after the country was formed in 1947. The Pakistani military holds significant influence over domestic politics and foreign policies and has staged at least three coups in a rule of more than three decades. Our Pakistan Bureau Chief Anas Malik is now joining us live from Islamabad for more on this. Anas Malik, good to see you. This new case could attract a maximum jail term of 14 years. What are Imran Khan and Qureshi's lawyers saying about this indictment? And what impact will this have on both of them, especially the former pra uh, pa Pakistani Prime Minister uh, who is in jail already? Well, Eric, this case particularly pertains to going and leaking and using state secrets for political gains. This is a cipher case in which Imran Khan was formally arrested on the 15th of August uh, this year. And uh, uh, since then, uh, then on the 29th of August, when the uh, Islamabad High Court had granted bail to Imran Khan in the case of Tosha Khana, in which he was uh, he was indicted and then uh, uh, convicted, and then subsequently taken arrest to serve his uh, under arrest to serve his jail term. Then only it came to light that he's already also under arrest in the cipher case. Now. Uh, Today he's been charge sheeted. The Imran Khan and Shah Mahmood Qureshi both have denied the allegations in the charge sheet that have been put against them. And uh, uh, what now? What we would now be looking at is that a formal trial will commence from Friday, that is the 27th of October. And uh, I, I think by uh, the end of the year, sometime in December, we would be seeing the verdict, uh, be the be that be guilty or not guilty, being announced sometime in the last week, last week of December or sometime in December this year. Eric, live from Islamabad, our correspondent, our chief Pakistan correspondent, Anas Malik. Thank you very much for talking to us today. We on is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news on the move.